Um, so, if you could all grab your seats and we're ready to introduce the moderator for this excellent next panel. Please welcome to the stage Carlos Gomez Mujica from Fundacion Endesa. Please, Carlos. Stay right. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so, I start and then I present the others? Okay, great. Uh, thank you very much for coming uh, to this stage, to the next big thing. Uh, today we're going to talk about those that are over 50 years old, okay? So uh, a, a full community of professionals that have a lot to give to us and that are finding it difficult to find a job, okay? So um, it all started a few years ago. Uh, you could see on the news we were getting out of the crisis, the financial crisis, and what you see is that employment rates were going up, but more than a million people, a million persons over 50 weren't finding a job and were in this situation for an average of four years. And those people have a family behind. So it, was, it is a real tragedy, a social tragedy, that we, ha we thought we had something to do with it. So we started and thought, okay, let's do what we usually do. So let's do a panel, get 100 people, 200 people, try to, try to get them some skills so that they can find a job. But we said 200 by 200, until we get to the million, we will never get there. We will never make a change. We will never be a unicorn. So we started thinking, how can we do it differently so that we can really reach society? We started to study what was on the market. We saw a lot of great initiatives, but they were all small and they were not connected. So we thought, hey, let's be the hub. Let's put all those initiatives, let's put them together and let's order them. Let's start to make a social change by first giving order to, the, to, to all these persons that when they lo lose their job, they find themselves useless, and it's not true. They still have a lot to give to us. Second, let's give those, organization, those organizations somewhere to talk, somewhere where they'll get to their target. And third, let's make noise that there is a generation that has still a lot of value to give to us. And it is not only about millennials, but it is also about the intergenerational work that can bring us to a new level to still be on the top of the hype. So we created Savia, and I'm not here to talk to you today because I'd like to, those that are the real uh, protagonists of this uh, transformation, to talk to you. So I'd like to welcome first uh, Carlos Plaza from Fajos Music Portal, who is somebody that got into Savia, and I think it has created some impact on you. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you very much. Okay, so um, I think that the path that has been led by, by Savia has been very well designed. Because if you, if you look at the, the acronym, the first letter, S, stands for serenity. And that is very important at this initial stage. Because when a senior professional finds itself without a job, usually the emotions that arise are anger, frustration, um, what do I do next? Uh, even, even depression. So, Savia allows you to look at your new situation from a different, from a richer, broader perspective so that you can see that what you have in front of you is not necessarily a problem. It could be a challenge. It could be an exciting opportunity to make a, 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 a next jump in your, in your professional career. So you can look back, close your previous professional stage, and look at the future with optimism. Now, Savia also helps you understand yourself better. Try to identify your weaknesses and your strengths. So it provides coaching tools to guide you, uh, to motivate you. Also, it helps you increase your chances of getting a better job. For example, for example, by giving you recommendations on how you can improve your curriculum or to allow you to use, uh, to make a better use of uh, the networking um, um, of, of the job market under the new digital era. Um, so, as you can see, this first step uh, is to allow you to, to really have a new insight on your new situation. And then comes the next letter, which is A 
for analysis. So now that you are on the right frame of mind and you look into the future with optimism, comes a time that you have to make a deeper analysis of where you are. What do I need to do to be more competitive in this job market? Maybe I have to develop new skills to be more competitive, or maybe I have special strengths, special abilities that I'm not taking advantage of. So for example, Sabia allows you to make a gap assessment. So if you identify, for example, that um, you have an area where you need to have additional training, then Sabia provides the tool for you to get that additional training. And if you have some special skills, then Sabia also helps you to make the most out of them to be competitive. Some of the things that uh, Sabia will provide, for example, is uh, tools in order to assess the level of knowledge that you have in some critical areas, like, for example, um, digital competencies or English. And if you decide to become, for example, an entrepreneur, Sabia is also there to support you because it helps you uh, develop your potential as a new business owner. So as you can see, uh, the path is very well thought of. And uh, once you have these uh, two initial steps, you're ready to design uh, your strategy. Uh, so I invite you to visit uh, uh, the, the, uh, the site uh, because it is a very interesting and well thought out tool. Thank you. Thank you very much, Carlos. Thank you. Thank you. Well, uh, now I'd like to welcome on stage uh, for Vision. I'd like to welcome Nacho Vinedo, who is the CEO of ISDI, uh, a great institution that is helping us to develop the, all the, uh, the, those seniors. Please, hello. Nacho. Can you hear me? Here, here. Hello. hello, hello. Now, OK. Hello, everybody. My name is Nacho Vinedo, and I am a digital optimist. And, and this is, I think this is very interesting, because it's a way to, to watch the future with interest. Not the future, the present. The present is different now. Everything has changed. Uh, and the digital world is mm, shaping a new future, a new present for us. Uh, I'm the CEO and founder of ISDI, which is a digital business school, which is present in uh, Spain, Mexico, uh, United States, and soon opening in other countries. And we basically train people to enter into the digital world, to lose fear of the digital world and to see all the opportunities that are, that are, that are here. So let me tell you something. Who, who, who here is above 50? OK. So we are very fortunate. We are really fortunate because we are living, thanks to the uh, improvements in health, in uh, science, in many ways, we are living a golden era. We will live probably up to 100 years old, uh, and we will live a healthy and productive life. And that's great. Um, what's the problem? The problem is that the, the way the world was created, uh, it didn't, it, they were not supposed to have people that live so long. So we have to change things, OK? Because we will live up to 100 years, and we'll probably work up to 90. And, and that would be great. I think this is a great opportunity for all of us. Yes, it is. Because in the past, the idea was that you, you died when you were 65. Okay? And the money you had as a subsidy was basically to pay your coffin. Okay? That was the original idea uh, of the jubilación. Okay? But now, the system does not work anymore. So we have to change our mind, and we have to change our attitude. And this is very much about attitude, about what we think we're going to do. And the idea is that in so a long life, we will have to remind ourselves once or twice or even three times. It's like there is a science fiction novel of a guy called Dori Kasparov, of a man who lives forever, and he changes profession across his life. One day he's an engineer, then he's a musician, then he's a biologist. OK, that's basically what we have to do. This is all about a concept that probably most of you have heard, which is uh, long life learning. But I'd like to call it lifelong learning, OK? Because we will live forever. We will have to change 
the things we were doing in the past. So the labels will not exist anymore. Maybe you study engineering when you were young, but nobody's, nobody wants you as an engineer when you are above 50. Well, that doesn't matter. You change and you live another life. Okay, that's what it's called looped education. And that's very, very, that's things that are happening in the States right now. People who start one clear path, then they change. Maybe you are a doctor, then you change and you are whatever, an engineer after 40 years of experience. That's good, that's creating experience, that's very good for your brain, and that's very good for your portfolio and for your curriculum as well. So why we are here? We are here to help you in this path, in the path of reinventing yourselves. Okay, and the idea is that maybe you were an engineer, or you were a doctor, or you were an architect when, uh, when you were 40, and that was really good for you, but now things have changed, and you have to reinvent yourself. So why don't you come to us through Sabia, and we'll help you to become a CRM expert, or a data analyst, or a digital business uh, expert. I mean, What's the problem of being uh, uh, any of those jobs if you are 60 or 70? There is no problem at all. There is lack of professionals in those fields, and that's basically what we train. Okay, so my message to you is uh, forget about the millennials. Okay, these are young people who don't know anything, and they will, we, we will pay them very little because they, they are coming from, from nothing, they don't have experience and long life to the centennials, which is the senior millennials, okay? And that's the attitude we have to do. We have to change. We have to think of ourselves as, as someone who have to live other lives, and we have to start changing the attitude first and then changing the way we, we want to be through training, okay? And we are with Sabia to help you get trained on those incredible professions that are appearing and that, that, that are coming right now and need centennials like like most of you so thank you very much thank you Nathan. thank you Nathan. thank you very much thank you very much so now for the eye for impact i'd like to present pablo and sergio who come from uh, global alumni and have a great experience to to show us thank you very much please please good morning, good morning everyone ah. okay good morning everyone uh, i I have the opportunity to begin to work uh, or know the, the, the Savia platform from the beginning of the, they, are, uh, they are put on March. Yes. So I was one of the first uh, users of that platform and it was a very interesting experience because I have obviously in the, I went out of the company and I, I have to reinvent me and um, I have some ideas, uh, have action plans. I'm a system engineering, and so I have very organized and very planified person. But um, when you are in, in, that, uh, in that situation, uh, your integrity and autoesteem is uh, not so strong, yes? So uh, we, ma we have to be, um, maintain the serenity, the calm, are um, the platform give me that sensation of I'm not alone. There are more people like uh, me in the same situation, and I have to put in movement. Yes, and for for do that, the, I have the ideas as I said before. But uh, the platform give me the road. Yes, and understand um, the actions we are thinking are um, little more organized, and it, and it was in the good way. Yes. Uh, uh, so for that reason, I, I began to analyze the situation, my own personal situation, the market, because uh, in the platform you can understand about the, what the companies are needs uh, in this moment, and it, I identify a gap between my expertise, my, know my knowledge, and the needs of the, of the company. So I define an action plan in uh, define what we want to do, yes, uh, because at the first time I'm looking for a permanent position, but there are another ways to work in this moment, yes, because in that sense, uh, for example, interim manager. Interim manager is, uh, is an important way to, from the experience, collaborate with the companies in a free format, yes. 
and the platform give me the environment to uh, contact the companies and another person with the same interest or complementary interest to make a, a solution. Uh, after that, I understand that I have to reinforce my education. So I, I decided to uh, do a master in, trans in, tra in digital transformation in the Instituto de Empresa. And uh, it was very, uh, very useful because I know another kind of persons uh, in different situations and in different markets. Yes? So open the eyes and open the mind yes? uh, to define and, and, and concrete. Uh, Posterly, uh, I, I define my action plan and I begin more focus looking for the, my new place. In that sense, it was very hard work because every day I wake up, put in the computer, and go, 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 yes? And the another day, the same thing. And the next week, the same thing. And the next month, the same thing, yes? I stayed in, the, in this situation for two years, yes? So uh, we have to be very calm and very um, serene to support uh, personally uh, that kind of situation, yes? Because I, I was a manager very, with a lot of responsibility, and one day from another, we are not have nothing, yes? Uh, after that, um, I understand uh, that uh, the, the platform helped me to define my own uh, personal mark. How I present, how is my curriculum, and how will do my entrevist. Yes, that is very important. And uh, for, con uh, for a conclusion, um, the road Savia uh, helped me to think like seniors, we have a lot of things to apport to the companies or the organizations. Uh, we are necessary in this market. But uh, the only, uh, we have a place in this market too. But the only, the real challenge is to find it, yes? The place is there, we have to find it. So we have to focus to that, yes? Uh, well, to conclude, uh, I, I have to say, uh, I begin to work this Monday in a new company, so I close this period of my life, <laughs> yes? And began another one. Uh, I invite of all, you, all you are in the same situation to, to be perseverant and the solution will be arrived. I'm available for, every, for everyone uh, who wants to understand better my experience. Uh, for, I'm available. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Sergio. Thank you. Pablo, you want to say okay. something? Okay. It's a little bit noisy here, but I will try to to myself, I will introduce myself. I'm Pablo Rivas. I'm the founder of Global Alumni, which is an ed tech startup that we are transforming education in the world. And we have break down the language barriers from the top tier one universities, such as Berkeley, MIT, or UCLA, or others. And we are bringing them into, into Spanish languages. So that's my background. That's what I'm doing right now. And I want to tell you the story on how I believe and how much I think Savia is contributing to the, to the society. Because as an ed tech startup, you can imagine that I hire basically millennials, which are great. But I can tell you that after my experience on hiring seniors, I can, I can only tell you that you should only hire seniors uh, in any um, place or positions you have open on your company. Why? Because millennials are great for some things, but seniors are much better for all the rest of them. Why? Because the motivations are different. Are different. They, they think different. They are all the schools for the good and for the bad things. So if they have the, their minds open to a new style of management, then they are the best. So in my experience, on my side, as an ed tech company that you can all imagine, again, that is based on technology, when I hired these seniors positions to my company, CFO, project management, uh, 
Tesla's also, well, many different positions in, in my company. When I hired these seniors, it completely changed the shape of the company. We introduce a lot of experience. The way the decision making, the millennials are everything is quite, is, is, sorry, is quick, is fast, is we need it now. And, and seniors are more calm, calm down. They really understand what they are doing. They, they are not on that hurry on, on, on thinking they, they are more paused, more calm down. So they see things differently. And from a point of view of a startup, I can only say that I'm going to hire a lot of more seniors uh, because the results are so great, so excellent, that, and it makes sense for me as a startup. So that's what Savia is, is doing, because it's insane to waste this seniority, this, this experience that a lot of people, a lot of managers had, and we are not using it. So, so that's my experience. That's what I wanted to share this morning. So I will only hire seniors. If you have any senior, any good senior seeking for a job, please reach me. I'll be very happy to interview them. Thank you. Thank you, Paolo. Thank you, Paolo. So lastly, for Alliance, I'd like to introduce Stephanie. Uh, she works in Masumano, which has been, is, and will be the key partner to make this truly alive. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you. The floor is yours. So, well, my name is Stephanie. I work in Fundacion Masumano in the corporate area, and our main mission is to humanize organizations. So we have gone through the Safia, uh, Savia path. We talked about serenity, analysis, having a vision, impacting, and my word is alliance, right? So with this word in mind, I'm going to focus on three main aspects or three main questions. And I, I want to be very realistic here, right? Because this is a very important part, the bond between corporations and senior talent. So the fir first question is, what's going on in the world, right? We all know that we live in a globalized world. There's no boundaries. Uh, the organization of the future pursues exponential growth. That's why we need alliances. We do not compete anymore, we do collaborate. So if we collaborate, we cannot go alone. We have to go together. This is why it's so important from corporations to have a very mm, strong bond between senior talent and companies. We cannot afford to lose this diverse talent. Corporations need to generate platforms like uh, Savia. We need to generate networks. We need to generate and move communities because there's a lot of things to take out of this and we need to generate win-win situations. Now, my second question is, what really happens in organizations, especially here in Spain? Well, I have to tell you that um, we are, I mean, corporations are working on the employee experience. You know, those touch points in the onboarding stage, the training stage, the career path. But there's a long way to go between the pre and the post retirement. There's a recent study from Instituto de Empresa where it says that 90% of corporations do not have formalized policies to engage or boost senior talent. So here we do have a very big opportunity. You know, we do have to do something, like what they say. We need to boost a social change. And from our experience in Fundacion Mas Humano, we have a, a lot of organizations that what we do, we don't have the magic answer to this, but what we do is to promote a uh, network. We try to learn from others, learn how to relearn, share knowledge. We do have sessions, benchmarking sessions to see what's going on in the market. We do have uh, swapping sessions. We cross professionals from one company to the other. So to see what does function in the market, what does not function, and what should we do different if we should start again, right? So the big question is, just to sum up, right? Um, whose responsibility is this? Whose is it? And we all think, well, it's my bosses. No, it's my company. No, uh, it's all of us. We have a responsibility here to change. We do have to change. And I really like this platform. I think it's an incredible initiative where uh, we put things together and like, well, I, I invite you to go like, you know, inside this platform, it's www.generacionsavia.org. And like a friend of mine says, and I want to finish with this, it's a platform that connects people, invites people, connects people, generates opportunities, and make real things uh, happen. Thank you. Thank you very much.
I have no chair. Thank you very much, Stefan. Thank you. Just let's sit down. So uh, just let me finish with a few numbers. In six months, we have more than 9,000 users. So we have more than 50,000 unique users getting into the platform. More than 250 companies have signed up. More than seven, we're collaborating with more than 78 organizations. Those are just great numbers. We're just starting, but we really want to make a social change that will put in value a generation that has too much, so much to give to us. So please thank this panel, who's been great, and has said a lot of great things for us. Thank you.